Hello there, this is Michael Keyes. Have you ever lost a listing because the seller said to you your fees are too high? Well, when a seller says to you your fees are too high, remember there is the reason given and there is the real reason. Why will a vendor choose an agent purely based on fees? Number one, they haven't found an agent they like and trust. Two, they don't believe the agent is a good negotiator. And three, they don't see you as competent. And here are the reasons you'll get chosen as their agent and get a good fee. One, you believe you are the best and are worth what you charge. In other words, you know that you are the agent who is going to put the most money in the vendor's bank account. Two, you build great relationships. And selling is all about relationships. When I first started in real estate, I went to a trainer and he said, you've got to get people to like and trust you. So when I went out door knocking, not only was I looking for people who wanted to immediately sell their house, but I was looking for every opportunity where I could build relationships with people. And I knocked on this door one day, and her name was Mrs. Bain, and she lived in Bain Street. And she said to me, Michael, I'm more than happy to talk with you, but I won't be listing my property with you because my niece works for another agent. So I went and had a cup of tea. I went back every quarter and had a cup of tea with her. I rang her once a month, said, how are you, Mrs. Bain? I sent her thank you notes, and about a year later, she rang me and said, Michael, I've got to put my house on the market. So I went out and listed it at the right price, charged the full standard REI rate in those days, and I sold the property. And I don't know what happened to the niece who was working with another agent, got no idea. But she obviously didn't have as good a relationship as I had with Mrs. Bain. And that's what relationship selling is all about. If you want a situation like I had with Mrs. Bain, and I can give you hundreds of stories about people who were just like that in my real estate life. But it all starts with this. If you don't have those relationships, you've got to look for every opportunity to build those relationships. And if you don't have those relationships, you're not doing enough prospecting. You're not going out and knocking on enough doors. Number three, the vendor understands that you'll always do what's in the vendor's best interest. Number four, you prove to them that you know your stuff. And number five, you prove to them that you're a great negotiator. And six, you prove to them that you're a salesperson and not just an order taker. So I want you to remember this. If your fee doesn't make you feel a little uncomfortable, then you are not charging enough. Now I want you to be present. I want you to be bold. I want you to be enthusiastic. And I want you to be getting a great fee and making more sales and creating more prosperity in your life. So to your success in real estate, until next week, this is Michael Keyes saying goodbye.